the boss, Ricky Rose. This is a one of one, never been done, self-made talks. I'm sitting here with three living legends. DJ Khaled, Lil Wayne, Wiz Khalifa. And once again, we here for one reason, being the greatest at what we do and also representing the greatest brands that's out here right now. And I'm gonna begin with Bamboo, Bel Air, McQueen, Vion, you heard me? And, and like I say, us being bosses, let's make a toast. Cheers. 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 Bless up. Bless up. Bless up. Bless up. Bless up. Bless up. Put your blood. First time I see that. That's legendary. Cheers. 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 Let's take them back to the beginning, brother. You one of the greatest at putting collaborations together, if not the greatest. Let them know where it began at. I mean, you know, at an early age, I would say probably like, um, you know, 10, I think I fell in love completely with just hip hop, you know, even earlier than that, but at 10 years old, because I started DJing probably like at 13, you know what I'm saying? But I remember at 10 years old, just, I love music so much. So I used to collect vinyl and cassette tapes, you know what I'm saying? Then I finally got one turntable. So, you know what I'm saying? Everybody used to come to my crib like, yo, put this song together or put this song. So I used to make, you know, you know how we got playlists now, now but you know, you got to calibrate. tape. But I wasn't trying to be like, you know, somebody that's to make, mixtapes, but I wanted to make it personal for my brothers and sisters, like like exclusive, like, you know what I mean? Like a certain playlist gotcha. for Lil Wayne or Ross might want to listen to certain vibes. I would put it together. And um, I always like reggae music too. So I was just around music so much that, um, you know, when I got introduced to a turntable, I'm like, I think DJing is perfect for me. And then I end up wanting to make music. And, um, you know, everything I did was just, Hip hop, I used to break dance, um, you know what I'm saying? You know, obviously get busy on the turntables, but it just took me to a whole nother level because I loved it so much, I didn't stop, you know what I'm saying? Because it got me to do radio. It got me to be with Lil Wayne, Rose, Wiz, and you know, this is what music did. You know, hip hop opened every single door for me, you know what I'm saying? I think for all of us, actually. You know what I want to say, <clears throat> and this may be the first time I ever told you this, brother, but I believe everything you just spoke on, those are your talents. But to me personally, this coming from Rose, you know what your true gift is? It's your authenticity. Thank you, brother. You being authentic. Thank you, brother. Because that's the only way you could gain the trust of a Wheezy, Absolutely. Wiz. You know how much it'll cost a right now to make that call or put that record together right now? <laughs> Wayne, Rose, Wiz, how many? We could name that and make that call that we'll do that for right now on some 1,000 shit. You yeah. feel me? Nah, nah, trust me. And you that love saying? and trust, that's genuine and you gotta earn that. And that's something you did, man, brother. you know, just sitting here at this table, man, like, um, just our history is, is, is beautiful. You know what I'm saying? Like, just to think about, you know what I mean? Um, you know, even, you know, especially with Wayne Ross, you know what I'm saying? You gotta remember, like, I was blessed to, to see Wayne, like, like at an early age, I used to work at a record store called Odyssey Records. And Lil Wayne used to be up in there, Carrollton Shopping Center, you know what I'm saying? And, and if I'm not mistaken, I think that's where Wayne, you know, got his got opportunity, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. To, to connect the dots and, right, you know what I mean? Yeah. You know, hit the pager and, and from there was history. So, you know, I got to see that, you know what I mean? And it was just like such a blessing. I tell that myself was, every day, was, like I, I seen this. That, that's most definitely not cutting you off, but a blessing in an era that we most definitely got to discuss with Lil Bro and by you bringing it up. It's just, my nigga, you the, you the gem of the hot boys. Whenever they gave you that play, big homie, you and the hot boys. Yeah. Did you know what that shit meant right then? I was way too young to, to understand the, you know what I mean, the the size of what was going on and what, what it could be. But they was cash money, as when I say they, they, when you're a kid, I was 12, 11. To me, in the city, I saw no further than the city. Right, the right, world right, didn't matter right, to right. me, I was 12 years old. Right, right. So in the city, cash money was already what we, what we, you know what I mean, what they, what we know them as now. There was, there was that in New Orleans, period. And so, just for them even, just in which, with in me, which I was, embracing. I don't care what it could have been, a cold boy, it's hot boy, I don't care what it was, I was good. <laughs> Hey, which which makes sense, man. 
But I'm a, you know, it's just me when I listen, when I go through the playlist and I listen to Cash Money, my I listen to all the legendary shit you've been a part of. It's just, damn. You feel me? Yeah. Because you knew, you knew you touched Miami in a special yeah. way. You know, my I'm talking about my niggas from Miami, from Lil Haiti, North Miami, Care Miami. Just 305 yeah. was just always yeah. and still is open arms to they cash embrace, money. And my niggas, us, yeah. you, you most definitely touched the city in a different way. Just to see where you are today, my It's like, damn, that shit historic. Love. For life. The main thing I took from Kevin's story though was I uh, used to what? Break dance. Yeah, I used oh. to. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they used to call me spe Special K. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's what I yeah. 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 We got Special you know, K out there, yeah. boy. I mean, you know, Ross asked, you know, from the very beginning, I just automatically thought, besides uh, what people should know or already should know, know right, right. throwbacks so. or something, you know, but I just remember, you know, knowing, like, man, I love this hip hop. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, you know, having a graffiti shirt that said Special K, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Yeah, the, you cutting the cardboard. You know yeah. No, I didn't know. I was good at the suicide, you know, like, you know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> nah, but. <laughs> nah. Hey, I'll do it again just to see you do. <laughs> I be I seeing you turn right up. No, I, I be seeing you turn up. I be seeing you do the footwork on that. I see it. I'm not doing that right now. You see it. That was good. It's still there, man. Nah, nah, but that was. You know, that In was my head. little thing, you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> Cheers to my brothers, Cheers. man. Our futures as well, health and wealth. We sitting here with my brother Wiz. We got a cool story of how we actually got to kick it for the first time. And let my bro introduce and do the vibes. So my story is like super crazy because I'm a product of all of y'all. You know what I'm saying? Like, your mixtape era, you going crazy. You figuring out exactly who the f Rick Ross is right at the time when you turned into the boss. And that shit just influenced me and, and infected me at, at such a crazy time where I was able to adapt and adjust and be like, you know what, this is what I want to do. You know what I mean? I looked at y'all and I known that y'all put in so much work to get to the point where y'all was at. And me being so free and understanding who I was at the time. I'm like, these are the who I look up to. No. This is how they do it, and this is how I'm going to do it. And I met you. I seen you perform at Summer Jam. I met you all on my way up, and I was like, I'm going to get to this point. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be right here with these. And that was my motivation, dog. And I'm right here now. So yeah. what the f***? Like, you know what I mean? Like, that's the biggest and the best thing and the most gratification, of course. I love my music and I want to rap and I want to, you know, kill these out here. That's that's our goal. But the camaraderie and the company that you want to keep and the greatness that you want to be in, y'all define that. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm man. a little homie, so you know what I mean? I came up in the internet <coughs> era. I was it's able to, era. you know, yeah, I, I was able to, I was able to, I'm like the last of the generation who was knocking on the doors and, and asking, can you come outside? You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there ain't no more of us. No more yeah, yeah, no, yeah, hell yeah. no, nah, that's a wrap. You wouldn't even let your kids do that, <laughs> would you? I wouldn't, I would not let my kid go up the Man, street. Ain't but no more. They ain't even trying to go outside. They no, <laughs> they want to play Fortnite. Yeah, they they want to stand doors all day on the phone. I'm the last the of shit. them, exactly. but I seen it on some shit where I was going to the, you know, the boutiques or the barbershop and still buying mixtapes. Uh -huh. And you know what I mean? When this was writing their flows, DVDs, eras, and all of that, that shit. Was dope. You know what I mean? That was like, dope. That was dope. That's what that raised dope. me and that's what put me in a position to be able to still have the integrity of music, but know where the where the, the money's at as well. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? And that's what we doing right here now is we mixing the integrity with the business side. And mm -hmm. that's what more people need to see. Uh, Definitely. Yeah, yeah. Sure. And when you speak of business, it's only right. How involved as artists should we be on our business side? I'm speaking music as well as outside of music. Yeah. Because we know when you're generating paper, we know how to go on a run and make a dub right, right yeah. quick. 30 right quick, you know what I'm saying? Right. How involved should we be when it's time to make another play? Out, you know what I'm saying? I think because we've I all think experienced our best. biggest success when we've been the most hands-on. Like, we've seen a lot of 
Who was like, oh, handle this, and we mm -hmm. tried that. Yeah, yeah that don't that's, work for that's us. That's the most bro. convenient, because when right. you're ripping and running, for right. one, majority of the time you're making an investment mm -hmm. in some you really don't have knowledge exactly. of. Other than the fact it's the homie came to you with the play. Right. But it's the play. Boom, boom, trust boom. Trust is everything. I mean, trust trust is, everything. is everything. Trust is everything in business. And going yeah. back to the hands on, when people see you hands on, mm -hmm. they're going to respect it even more. Yeah. Even more. You know what I'm saying? So, Definitely. You know what I mean? Like, and especially, you know, we blessed to do things that we want to do. And I, I encourage anybody to do anything in business to love it so you could put that extra grind work because you love it. Yeah. And then it'll pay off bigger than ever because you love it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes. You know, if you think about it in business, sometimes that, you know, you got to do things you might not be in love with, but just to fund the business that oh, you want to be in love right, with. Right, right, right. So, you yeah, know, we want to encourage business. everybody to be self-made and at the same time encourage everybody, yo, sometimes you got to hustle, hustle to fund what you love. Yep. You know what I'm saying? I think that's important because, you know, this didn't happen overnight. No. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we put in that work to be able to say we want to do this and do that. Because we put in that grind. Absolutely. As far as hands on in business, coming from coming from under uh, Stun and Slim, I literally I've literally never seen. They've never had a boss, and my, I've never right. seen them right. answer right. to no one. Yeah. True. Right. And right. so True. Right. and so I always knew once. And then they, the way Baby is, and the way Slim is, when they give you, it can be. A lighter, if they would, when they give you something, they make sure you know it's yours, mm -hmm. and they make sure everyone knows it's yours. Mm -hmm. You know, he gonna get on every interview and let you look the key. Wayne got the keys. He he taking it. This this all when it was Juvie. Time. Look, Juvie when it was BG. Yep. Look, and so that that way, where you already knew if you was to follow the program and get every and do the things you're supposed to do, you know that what I'm gonna become my own boss one day. My, my damn self. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Trust the process. Yeah, trust the process. Like a muff, bro. Man. So look, right now I think for the youngsters who watching the position we in, you feel me? How do you still motivate yourself? I want to know how do you get up every day and still mm -hmm. go hard? My mother, I hear the habits. I hear how hard yeah, I know, know I exactly what you're talking about. You understand? Right. I'm with how you. do you, for the ones, because the is that something that they <laughs> can read it. and learn, or that's <laughs> something that's <laughs> got to be in there? I have the answer. <laughs> um, you know, first of all, you know what I'm saying? You know, you know, I want to, you know, we got to always thank God, you know what I'm saying? For, for life and the blessings yeah, and opportunities. But for me personally, you know, my kids, you know what I'm saying? It's not about me no more. It's like, it's not about Khaled, it's not about DJ Khaled, it's about my kids, mm. you know what I'm saying? And so everything you see me do, you know what I'm saying, just know I'm doing it for my kids. Long term. Yeah, for my family, and, I, and that's my motivation because, you know, we bless to be able to put our kids in position early. You know what I'm saying? If you think about what we're talking about from, you know, Odyssey Records to, you know, you coming up from the internet era and mm -hmm. Ross, you coming from the streets with it, and, and but now we have kids and we can put them in position to pass all that mm -hmm. and put them in the right position if we continue to be great. You know what I'm saying? And that's my motivation. And my to family. touch on that, before when you was an entertainer and you had kids, you had to separate that too. Yeah. And it was like, oh, you gotta understand I'm our bro. generation. Da, da, da. Our generation blah, 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 bro. We're breaking that's, that. That's man. what I'm trying to <laughs> say. You feel me? Like, you know what I'm saying? And we got our kids with us. We got them flying with us. We got yeah, them backstage. Yeah. It's the most beautiful hey, thing in the world. Hey, if I smart a little bit, hey, my kid might like be there this. too. You know what I'm saying? It, it's, it, it is what it said, is. The answer is the answer. Also, the answer to that, not to cut you off. No, nah, you good. He said, trying, the great, trying to be great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, was, sure. uh, I once heard that uh, the definition of great is uh, a greatness is when you can't explain it. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Like LeBron, mm -hmm. you know, like uh, you, we can't explain. He's, 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 he's the, look at him. Right. right. That's why. Right. You know, like oh, if you ask, why is he so, look, look at yep. him. You know, you can't explain Tom Brady. Yep. You can't, like, he's yeah. a yeah. zillion years old. Yeah. I don't know why he's Come doing on now. that. Come on, that's Tom you know Brady. I mean? Come on. 
I'm, 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 I'm talking about a million years old. Uh, come so, on, Dad. Uh, so, he's, uh, come so, on, now, now, come, come, let's get ready. Right, 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 he's like 43, something like that. It's as high, and, and we ain't seen nobody do that since like George Bland or somebody like that, or Warren, Warren Moon or somebody like that. Warren Moon, I got to so see you. Can't, you know, and so we, but we had, we had, we had definitions for why yeah. that happened when Warren Moon was doing it. It was because it was there was way more than just Warren Moon doing it at that time. That was because that was the way football was, and that was right, the era. Right. That's no longer the that's no longer the answer for time. You right. know, so there's no answer. The answer is just uh, just because it's him. Yeah. So when it's just right. great, when you can't explain it, I believe that's the answer for why we stay motivated. I know I chase greatness every day. I I have no I have no answer for why I was five years old and can not wait till my grandmother called me up front to the living room so I could perform for her and her yeah. her friends. Yeah. I have no reason. I have no answer for why I didn't want to watch cartoons instead. Yeah. You know what I mean? yeah. So. Well, you That's can't amazing, explain bro. it. Then. Yeah, 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 there's yeah, there's yeah. so Especially. many like, I work out at a gym. There be like actors and shit like that, and they do. Shit. They don't know how much money they making for that shit, bro. <laughs> they don't even ask because it's for somebody else. It's not for the money. It's not for the exactly. benefit. Exactly. They already made that. They already done that. They yeah. already didn't lived every dream that they could, bro. They're at the point where they're like, yo. It's a great point to be at, man. Yeah, that's that's yeah. amazing, bro. That shit feels point so bad, bro. bro. You know, um, also, I think, you know, for all of us, the motivation is also to bless others. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know get like, back, man. Yeah, and that's what we do. And, 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 and th those around us. Yeah, exactly. And it's yeah. like, it's beautiful because, you know, you wake up every day, and that's part of being great is blessing others. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And then, you know, family is... You know what that is. Mm -hmm. yep. You know what I'm saying? It's like when you say best and others, when you when you come from when you do it like uh, again, coming from baby coming from around baby and them, everybody they ever employed was was, uh, was was people who was from from around from from mm -hmm. us, family mm -hmm. or whatever, or friends or whatever, close friends. So Never seen them go out and go uh, so I, I stuck to the same stuck to the same thing. So when you say the best part about it is when you know how far you and your you and your people came, you know, so that's that's always a blessing nah, to us. I remember you was this man. Look at when you see your homie pulling up and coming, and his gift to you is a McLaren. Yeah, you know, he's like, man, we all right. We're gonna be all right. We're gonna be all right. Yeah, we did good. That's what it's all about, for sure. Yeah. That's the motivation. When your homie's birthday gift to you is a McLaren. Yeah. When man. you've done, when you've worked your. <laughs> Talk that much to your homies <laughs> birthday yeah, we, gift to you. We know yeah, that man. Man. You know, that's your motivation. Man. That, man. We already seeing the new year. We already speaking it into existence. We already off to a start. Yeah, I'm already we are the baton. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm back like, in the sky. I, I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm like in 2027. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, I would say further, but you know, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna just let you know. You know what I love about going back to the, the hustle and the motivation, because we love this shit. We do. You know what I'm saying? And, and the minute we say we, you know, you know, you know, we all get those times that, you know what I'm saying, you know, we work off inspiration, you know yeah. what I'm saying? And, you know, music, you know, every time I drop an album, I'm like, yo, you know, I'm gonna I'm, I'm drop my album, but I'm gonna wait a little while, but then mm. boom, I, I see myself back in the studio already, just, working you know, on working on another one, and don't even know it. And then be like, yo, oh no, this it gonna be a problem. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, you already getting inspired. So obviously new music. Um, but I'm 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 blessed to be able to um also open up new businesses. Yeah. And um outside the music, I'm gonna have some, you know, I, I can't give you the official announcement yet, but I got some things on the retail space mm -hmm. um where I'll be opening like two special stores that I'm really excited about. I got, some, I got some new Jordans coming out in 2022. Yo, shout out to Jordans, man. Yeah. Shout out to Jordans. Yeah, man. I got, shout um, out to Jordans. Why you ain't never hollering me, but it's another no, question. No, 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 man. No, no. Um, <laughs> I was just trying to give you some more. No, 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 no man. man. It's the self-made talk, so that's yeah. what we were supposed no, with to you. do. Hey, look, look, look what breakdancing got me. Man, that's where right. I'm at now. Nah, I'm sitting beside I call. Big time. You was in Odyssey, man. I know that for a fact. Wayne Chapman, tell him. Odyssey will be... I don't know the schedule, but I know for a fact on like every Thursday or you something. You remember seeing this? Like, what? You remember walking in there, seeing him? So the story, in, what, this come is on, how, man. This, this is special, how, this man. How I went. I was in, I was Cause in, I, you gotta understand. I was in now, fifth grade. Man, this big. I was in fifth grade. And so we had just put the album out. We, Cash Money had put the album out, True Story, BGs. People, yes. people thought that BG 
was was um, who we know BG as today. Right. But that wasn't, it was BG's, it was us. It was him and I, we were a group. A group? Yeah, my mama pulled me away from the from the group during the recording process because of the school school time and it wasn't right, going, right, working right, right. right. Still ended up on four songs. The album cover was just a, just said true story. It was like a blue. Book. It was, yeah, right, like right. A, some, some, some hood, hood shit, classic yeah, hood shit had back no then. Pictures. Right. So to show my homies in school that I'm telling every damn day that, nah, nah I got an album out, you tripping. I'm really with the with cash right, money. Right, it's, it's really. I gotta bring them, if, okay, if your mama agree for you, if you can lie to your mama or whatever, to where you ain't gotta go straight home after school, then come with me and we, on Thursday. We're gonna walk, we're gonna take you to Odyssey. Only reason why I'm gonna take you on that day is because I know he gonna be in there, the DJ dude yeah. is gonna be in there. I used to, I used to have a turntable behind the counter in the record store. In there, in the record store. Y'all be cutting it out when people in, walk in. When you That's walk hard. in, he cool. He ain't about to be tripping like when they have the regular workers and people that's working there that's not about to that's about to ask you do y'all need some help or something <laughs> he ain't about to do that but he about to when i walk in there i'm all, I'm, i might can even just ask him I ain't telling this me bro yeah, yeah. you know what i mean he was so, a real one back then yeah, too that that's was, that's that's crazy about that um, that's hard, like, bro. i gotta see i gotta that's, see that's, slim that's, and birdman pull up yeah, to the front of the store they should pull up to the front of the store like, open the trunk, bring boxes of cassettes, and that BG, I'll never forget that album, mm. and be like, boom, and I have to like report it to the owner, his name was Gary. Gary. So I would write it down, boom, boom, Gary. and then I put the tapes in the little thing, right? Soon as they leave, Ross, no lie, sold out in less than an hour. Damn. All right, so then every record company would call the store, like, yo, are these guys really selling this, this, and I'm like, this <laughs> Sold out already. The I, store I, I don't was know buying them on consignment, or they was getting know. the money. So oh, here comes copy. Birdman and Slim again. They back, they, bring, they kept God bringing the, the cassettes out the bro. trunk. That's so cold. I got to see all that. Shit. So again, like you know, I, God bless me to see this shit and to be a sponge. He's pulling up in that brown bin. That's what I'm trying Ooh. to show you. I got to see this. Shit. Not like hear about it. Right, right, you know, right. read about it. No, I seen that. You got to feel it. Yeah. So. You know what I mean? And that was me as a kid. Kyler kid. was there when I got my deal. Kyler was there on, at the day that, that Cash Money was doing the autograph signing, and I was in line to get my autograph signed. Yeah, Dude, that, he was this there. This shit is real, homie. Yeah, you know what this there. shit is? He was working. And, this, and then it was <laughs> so beautiful crazy. when I moved to Miami. That's insane, fool. I've been in Miami for about 27 <laughs> years. You know That's that. crazy. I've right. been in Miami for like 27 years, and then when Wayne moved to Miami, it was like, what the f you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I was, was literally my finna say that shit. It was like, how does it feel to do that shit again? <laughs> no, it's crazy. Nah, when he moved to Miami, like, when he moved nah, to Miami, I, got a question I was for you know, all trying to make it. That's and that's he was in the studio every day. Because all I remember is, you know that I'm so hood. Yeah, right yeah, one of the biggest. Oh, that that inspired a whole that's that's that, No, 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 hey, no, no. Me, y'all didn't put in all listen, that listen. work to go. That I'm so hood was so special. I know what it did for Rose. <laughs> I know what it did. I know what it did for Rose. So Weezy, I love you and thank you for that, brother Kelly. I love you and thank you for that, brother. I know what that was. I know. You feel me? Listen. And, and speaking of the I'm so hood, I, I call Rose. You know, this is when hustle and blue. Mm -hmm. And Rose, you know, that's my brother. Mm -hmm. Like for real. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I see Rose every day. Yeah. And he blew up that hustle and so big that the man was booked out seven days a week. You know how we go. You know what? Y'all gone. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's a bad yeah. every day of show. I'm like, yo, Rose, I need a verse. And you know, I ain't I ain't the Khaled, you know, I'm I'm trying to make it. Off the plane. I was on the radio doing a mix. I mean, he laying off the plane. I tell my girl, open the door, Rose coming, let him in the garage studio. They record I'm so hood. That man recorded I'm so hood. Boom, jumped in his car and went back to the airport. Boom, and it was can just I, Can I speak to yeah, that? go ahead. Can I speak to that? You don't mind me speaking on that? Of course not. Let me let you know something about Rosé. So I've been, y'all, obviously y'all know I'm a dinosaur. I've been doing this for a long fucking time. Rosé, 
Rose pen. Rose was the pen. The pen. When I mean the pen, he wrote. He wrote a lot. Of, he wrote the songs to so many songs that y'all are singing oh, today. Yeah, yeah, that yeah, he yeah. he's not on them. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's not on them. They're done by superstars. Yeah, yeah. And I won't speak and on. And we won't speak. <laughs> on, and we won't speak <laughs> on them because we we both have done such <laughs> such yeah, such a thing. No face, but no man, face. But man, so, so when he say when he say he jumps off a plane and go do the no, verse, and the, it's Rose been doing that since I was. I was recording in a place called Circle House that was owned by a group named Inner Circle. Inner they made Circle. the song Bad Boys, Bad, Bad Boys, Boys, What, what You Gonna, gonna do? do? Yeah, what so do? take it all the way back. That's how I was recording in their house. <laughs> Slime was there, right. recording for other people, right? Penning for other yeah. people, making sure they get the shit right. So yeah. when you My see name. somebody like that come up and you're like, man. And also Khaled, Khaled, he flipped it so much and became such a such who he became. I had to I had to question it. Like, is that homie from Odyssey? <laughs> like, is that homie? Because I don't know no, homie was gonna be doing all this. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, like, no, no, I don't know no, he was the DJ or this, but I ain't know he was gonna be popping like that. Nah, that, that's him. Yeah. I gotta I tell the story because so Wayne Wayne is here, so mm -hmm. <laughs> um, you know, because we're talking the I'm So Hood era. Tell him about the Afro. I ain't gonna and say nothing. <laughs> and when we did We Taking Over. You know, we t this is this this my my opinion. We taking over Lil Wayne verse, probably the to me, Insane. the very best verse in. That verse was you broke no, no, the beat no, 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 down no, 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 for us. No, 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 Keep talking about it. Let's cut it out. Listen, I don't know if I don't know if I'm on no, the song. Hold on, you went the hell so, off. I'll tell you, dude. You don't know what verse you're you talking about freak right off. now. So when he asks you, so if you have that question about what's what's your motivation, again, it's when. You can't even explain it. That's I don't even know what he's talking well, about. I, I, I don't even I, know what verse I, I want to let the people know this, though, Ross. But thank you. I love that. No, listen. That's some special No, but listen, the day we recorded that verse, I'm in the studio with Wayne. Wayne was at Hit Factory. He had like the one upstairs, his own little okay, corner. That, that you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That was, Wayne was, that was his own vibe. Um, In fact, they, I'm going to be honest. It was one time, nigga, that was cash money. Oh, studio, no, 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 <laughs> no, it was. I'm talking about for years. But the thing is that he recorded that verse. I was in the studio. He was smoking like he's smoking now. The only difference is he was rapping, smoking, rapping. And he did like 30 records in my face. No, no, wrong. He did like 30. And 30 <laughs> records that you hear on the radio right now. Yeah, 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 without no, a doubt. Not, not, not like no, not, records. No, not like just doing like shit hits. to be doing it. Yeah. No, 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 no. Yeah. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. back to back. I, so I'm I, like, I, damn, how do I? Like, get into this. Like, man, it's the 30 yeah, yeah, yeah. records. I'm like, yeah, he got to be tired. Or am I playing myself? Yeah. Like, it's like, nah, let me get one. He's like, yo, Cal, pull up the one you want. He said, I never remember this, bro. So I pull up. I pull up. Brown paper bag, and we taking over. Mm -hmm. He was showing his zone. I said, Fuck it, I got two to play for you. <laughs> now, I ain't crazy. So I played him brown paper bag, and we taking over. He did, we taking over. I lost my mind, right? <laughs> now I'm like, this man, this man, <laughs> this man different. And that's my brother, and that's no Lil Wayne. I'm like, no, no, so no it's, like a, it's like, I'm like, and I'm, he's smoking, and I'm not smoking. I'm like, ha. <laughs> so listen. Then he pulled a brown paper bag, I pulled a brown yeah. paper bag to play for him. Yeah. He said to me, oh, no, nah. I got, I, I got, I got to go different from this one. <laughs> and the other ones, he just kept going, boom, boom. And then he came back, I got it. <laughs> I, I forgot only one's name, you called somebody and you said it, a fee or somebody, because you, you said it in the verse and he said, uh, some some moved to Miami and kept treating me like an orphan and a dolphin and a sharp. This shit is start. I'm like, nah. <laughs> I knew it from that day. Yeah. I knew it. I said, this man, you know, you know, we ain't have Instagram and all this shit. Y'all ain't see what I seen. Yeah. The man that start, he did 30 hit records that you hear every day of your life today. Yeah. <laughs> Today, this ain't this ain't like somebody rapping and right. no no hits. No, no, no. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And then do we take it over and brown paper bag? Right there. <laughs> Y'all think I'm tripping? This, this nah, you, you gotta understand. That. You know what I'm trying? I'm saying yeah, like those are the moments that make me keep going. Nah, that's it. Really.
Because you fact, knew. Listen. He was in his bag. He I'm going to be real with you. Ross, in the bag, bro. He was in his bag, bro. Wait, not because Ross is here, not because Wayne is here, but these two artists <clears throat> on everything I love. Dude. You send them a record, that shit come back that night or the next day. <laughs> and sometimes it's been done. God forbid the engineer forgot. Yeah, yeah. It's been done. <laughs> You know what I'm trying to tell you? I see, bro. I, I, I probably went home and the engineer. No, no, it's, 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 and he's a bit. He didn't know to send it yeah. to Mac yet. Like, come on, yeah, bro. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. I yeah. remember coming off a tour. I'm. Come on, bro. Talk to him. <laughs> Man, I can't. Please don't shit, stop, bro. Preach, bro. No, church. No, usually I come tell on, you stories. No, usually hey, I tell you stories. No, 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 I usually tell you stories. No, preach, bro. Without showing my face. No, preach, bro. This is. I'm just being. I want. I want you. This is real talk, bro. Preach. Man, I love this, man. You gotta understand, like. We still doing this shit on high levels. Mm -hmm. I look up that's all the, three of y'all. That's the blessing. Same with you. I remember I'm the young you. homie, bro. I'm, 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 the, the, little, I'm, the, I'm the little homie. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. I'm, 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 I'm here because I'm here because of y'all. That's what I love. I'm that's here to I soak love. up game. I'm here, always get to I'm here because of game. Tell right I haven't even I haven't even done half of what I'm supposed to be doing. But the the way that y'all paved the way. Music wise, business wise, personality wise, putting on for other people wise, that's what I look up to. You know what I'm saying? I say Taylor Gang, cause it's Taylor Gang. Yeah. Right. With me, me without. You know what I'm exactly. saying? The collective. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. And we work hard. We in the studio every day. I seen you recording in the hotel room, bro. Definitely. You know what I'm exactly. saying? That's legendary. Yeah, definitely. Oh, no. I, I, know, I know. I yeah. know. I know Fuck you be yeah, be before you broke so many people's careers. Thank you. You've been in so many influential moments. You, come on now, he already done said it about writing, putting it down. But as far as being a boss, you flew me out to your crib, dog, as a young dog. I remember that. A lot no, of don't even you. know this. I was still on my internet stage. Rose hit me up. Rose, Yo, was, Rose was up on that Wiz yeah. early. Early. No, no, no. I was like, man, he was up on. I, I learned Wiz through Rose. I came in front. Yeah, you yep. know what I'm saying? I'm going to be real with you. I knew, I knew the story. Yep. Many as in, I heard some of the records, but I really, yep. like, because I used to see him in the studio together. I'm like, damn, Rose up on this early. Mm -hmm. And the game was changing at that time, too. You yep. know, like you said, it was, I guess it was the internet era, whatever. Internet era, and Wayne had changed it to some rock stars. Yeah, well, he was dude. in the rock shit. Yeah. It was like, yo, it's not just rap shit, it's rock star. You can it could be anything at that point, yeah, nigga. That you point. Could By the it. way, um, that black and yellow brother. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Wayne made it acceptable. Yeah. Yeah. Black and yellow, yeah. what I mean? Let's talk about ganja. Let's talk about ganja. Let's talk about, let me finish my shot. <laughs> let me fin finish your shot. Finish your shot. Kelly, yeah. you finish your shot. I'm on the champagne now. I need that. Let's All appreciate right. these brothers for their contribution oh, man. to we the ganja community. We can never do that enough. Come on now. Like, you got Khalifa Kush, of Khalifa course. Kush. I'm not that's gonna lie. I, I got the best weed in the world. Now, this <laughs> what I'm, listen, listen, listen. This is what I'm gonna say. My brother gave me a handful of gas. An hour he ago, told me that I set me the f and down. Now I need it. I so need I'm getting with it. The Khalifa Kush weed. getting the thumbs up from Rose. I'm talking about all the way. I'm talking about. I told my dog he can't leave without now getting up. Totally, I, got for real. Real. I wouldn't even feel right if I didn't. Burner's my OG. Burner put my me on. OG yeah, as well. yeah. Burner put me on to real good weed. So I'm gonna tell y'all the story. I'm from Pittsburgh. Yeah. We smoke big weed out there. So my whole life, I've been on this on the fucking search for the best weed in my life. Just been smoking. I'm the young homie. I went to the bay. I called Mr. Fab. Fabby said, right, right. I don't smoke, but I'll tell I you what it got. <laughs> Send me the burner and everything, smoking, everything, smoking everything changed ass. ever since then, bro. I got the Khalifa Kush on deck. But you always smoking, always smoking. In the photo shoots, uh, when the magazines was popping, it bring the when best the DVDs out. was cracking, uh, anytime you hooked up with Jewels, Emma, mm -hmm. Jim and them, y'all niggas smoked heavy. Like, I always oh, looked up for y'all to y'all for the smoke, just for bringing it to the forefront. Like, really just being on some, yo, we on some Jamaican, we on some whatever exactly. it is, motherfucker. Like, we rolling joints like this, pounds of that. Like, the way that y'all started it is the way that I was able to kind of, like, make it friendly. You know what I mean? Yeah. And people, 
always give me credit and say, yo, you crossed over weed. I'm like, you don't even know the who I look up to who been putting in that work, fam, and still putting in that work. And gonna always smoke. Always putting in that work. Nah, this y'all, work. y'all my big homies, and I appreciate all the work that y'all put in for the weed game. All right. Man. Yeah, yep. And man, I'm gonna make a toast to K- Khalifa Kush. Yeah, cause, cause this some gas right it's here. It's the right? one, not the two. It's nah, the one. Really <laughs> like I know you really love that shit, cause you really. Yeah, he really. No, 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 I believe you. Yeah. Like, if you didn't think I, be, I believe you. No, it's, it's really no, like I, that. I'm gonna keep real. If it wasn't, like, I, I know. These smoke <laughs> weed though. I'm not sure I'm trying to tell Big you. Weed. I'd be chilling if it wasn't. No, it's. <laughs> yeah. Trust me, that's so what I'm saying. Three of us in the same room, that's like a. Oh, it's legend. That's yeah. a lot of. So look, on some cool shit, right? Imagining where we at right now. And we ain't finished, we far from finished. Nigga got too much greatness. Mm-hmm. Too much greatness, too yeah, much greatness, yeah. right? And of course we don't know these answers, but how do we go out? Of course we all can patch up. Get us some money, we could get us we we could get us a piece of the dolphins, we could get us a piece of the heat, we could get a piece of the green bay. We might be able to get us ten percent of goddamn. You know, you know we seventy seven year waiting list to get a piece of the green bay. We No, we gotta skip that. We the only team in the league without an owner. Who that? Green Bay. We don't have what you mean? The team is owned by the uh we have we have almost I think about we, probably over 100,000 on the team. They got to let us skip the, the waiting list, the, though. No, the team has, our team is the only team that, you know, we're over 100 years old. So the team was bought by the community. They, they was bought by the community. So now oh, it's a yeah, 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 spread it yeah, out the shares. Yeah, and so, yeah, yeah so, yeah. yeah. yeah that's why I, I we're going to make people own that. So look, yeah, that's why they go so hard. Let's just splash just splashing ideas. <laughs> how do we go out on? How do we go out with a bang? And of course, we ain't talking about now. We talking about, but well, what's the play we make that we could just plant a seed on right now before we leave and say, "Damn, that was some gangster shit right there." Cause y'all know we could do some boss shit like. Y'all see how we rocking right now. We representing the best brands. Mm-hmm. We know we could get money with each other. You know, you know the big boys, they call them PayPal Mafia. I don't know if y'all know about that. But that's when, you know, a bunch of rich mom come together, yep. boom. We get we create businesses, give each other's equity in each other's business. Mm-hmm. So you got another whole type of drive and motivation to go out there and rep the yep. set. Yep. Yo, man, we repping. This what we drinking today. We drinking mm-hmm. it. Yo, we done drunk some of it. You feel me? Right. So how do we do something that's legendary and go out on motherfucking top? Some shit ain't never been done. We already doing shit that's never been done, but how do we motherfucking put? Because we got to do something that's, come on, man. You hear the story, you y'all just. Off. That's some shit. I, I've been knowing you over 20 years, homie, and never knew that. Yeah, yeah. Nah, and I mean, that's why the love has always been genuine. I mean, I think, I think, I think, uh, you know, you know, we embrace the young world. You know what I'm saying? Like, and and and, you know, you, uh, you know, I'll be saying, you know, the, you know, the new teeth and the no, new your bottles. Teeth wonderful Thank too, you, brother. Hey, come on, man. Come on, wait, come on. I can't believe I waited this come long. Come on, man. Like, I can't believe I nah, waited this long. Nah, he pulling his cheek back and off. I can do all that. Go for but, um, but anyway, so listen, <laughs> no, I'm saying like, yeah, it's a new world, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's about just basically taking, you know, you want, you want, like for me, it's, it's for my kids to be able to do anything they want to do, but to be also to give them what we worked hard for them to take it to the next step, it's theirs. And you pray that, you know what I'm saying, they, they inspire others too. Like you said, like, you know, the PayPal, how everybody, okay, this is what you're doing create, today. Yeah. Uh, you got uh, 20%, you got 50%, you got whatever equity, boom, boom. Just keep everything going. Keep everything going. Just keep everything going. I think that's the key. But you know, I want, I want everybody to know here, we forever. Without a doubt. We bless. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But we also going to inspire the, the next generation and the other generations and our, and our kids' kids to, you know, keep going. Mm-hmm. And that's what it's about. Just keep going. For me. For me, there's no... Uh... I keep, uh, forever is a strong word, and that's the word I live by. There's yeah, that's no, what I'm on. There's no end. Uh, for me, though, it's always my musical peak. You know how you say you had those 
posters and you envision just I still obviously I have I don't have no posters but I still envision I still I still haven't reached that vision I see myself as my musical peak as you seen, you haven't, you I haven't no I'm not the I want to be the ultimate artist I, I want to be the I ultimate artist and I what I mean that. by that is I want to I want to when I go on stage and when you come to a Wayne show someday I want it to be full of, you know what I mean, full of everyone because they, I, you know how we have to do when you do a festival, you got this certain type of music at this time and slide and all that. I want to be in all those time slots because of who I am and I want to be right. the number one in all those time That's slots. Right. So, having reached my you musical earned that. Peak, You so. most definitely earned that, brother, and, and I love it and that's, that's what makes you special. It's something you can't explain, but it's most definitely understood. You feel me? Uh, I'm at the point, um, I'm probably like the youngest out of all of y'all, but I be feeling hella mature. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and um, being that I grew up in the internet era, I'm moving backwards. So everything was so technological for me. Mm -hmm. So now I'm just all about reading and just anything that I don't know is just investing my mind into that. And I love really, it. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, because we got great natural talents. But to learn that shit, you know what I mean, piece by piece, and that's what I feel like other they need people to hear have. That. They yeah. need to hear that. Yeah. They need to hear that. They yeah. need to know. They need to actually, um, they need to listen to that. They mm -hmm. need to listen when you say that, that going back and paying attention to, yeah. That's, Hell yeah. Hey, it was too technical. I mean, it's all in the awesome. book, bro. Yeah. They, and they say that. They be like, yo, if you want to hide something, somebody, somebody put it in the book. <laughs> 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 that shit. Deep to That's me. dope. And they used to burn books back in the day, bro. They ain't burning iPhones, fam. So I'm I'm in them books right now. Audio book. Audio book. Knowledge. Audio book. That's crazy. That's I, just, I, love that. I bought I love my that. first audio book I bought was crazy. So that's crazy. And it's, it, it was make I went back to pay attention to something I didn't know too much about and was want to find out more about. So that's all. That's, so, yeah, that's so, mm -hmm. so, question. I'm an author myself, but for somebody that's never had an audio book, when do you enjoy it? Is that something in the car? That's at the crib. It's That's a, when you sipping on something and smoking. Time. It's, on, it's yeah. on however you. I mean, I always have people morning, have a different. Up, I have. I have people have. That. People always have a different answer. So Absolutely. For me, it's just when I'm just dolo. Yep. When I'm yeah, dolo, ain't nobody time. around, and I think it's also because of the book. I ain't want nobody to judge me because of the book I had got. So right, 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 right. I gotta listen to it on my own. I ain't want nobody that boy. You crazy? <laughs> <laughs> You don't need <laughs> You in the corner like this. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I got that. But I'm like, really that's enjoying that. I'm the headphones nah, on that one. I'm joining, <laughs> I'm joining being around legends. I'm inspired. You know what I mean? Because I still believe in being inspired myself. Regardless of what a motherfucker may feel, I'm still around different energy. You know, it could be a motherfucker. I'm at a store we met wherever it's at, but most definitely around you individuals, man. I'm motivated. I'm inspired. You know, we here, I'm enjoying the, the vibes. I done took me a few shots to the gym. Can I have me another shot, please? <laughs> Let's go. Man, I need, I need, wins, I need me one more shot. I'm, sip, I'm sipping on the- Love you for that, bro. On the bell and, you know. You know what we can't be field testing without real in the field, bro. No, nah, no, nah, we gotta be Maybe in the field. Here. I appreciate you for bringing me to the brand, too. Man, we family, man. My boy, Brett, he was like, you know what? Shout out, Brett. Yeah. Man, you know Brett, one of the coolest <laughs> motherfuckers in the world. My this is what I want to know. I got. A, I, I just got a question. You know, what was it like when you met the homie Brett for the first time? Kelly, what I'm, was it like when you met Brett? <laughs> no, Brett, the, Brett no, no, listen, the crazy thing about Brett, no, Brett, no, 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 no listen, I'm about to- Cheers, Yeah, bro. You keep well, it. Yeah, this is, yeah, yeah, cheers to Brett. No, 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 no this one for Brett. This one for Brett, bro. No, Brett, my God, listen. <laughs> you know, Brett got the same birthday as me. Okay. Okay. So like, I can believe that. No, 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 no. no. And the thing is that, you know what? I can believe that. You yeah. feel me? No, but let me tell you. You can see it. Mm -hmm. No, but yeah. let me tell you, because be, Brett, what I like about him is that he don't stop. No. Nah. Oh. This man. He one of us, This man. No, no, no. No, no, I get it. No, <laughs> no I get it. So, so now I can. No, it's scary. <laughs> and then I, now I can see like, okay, I see. It so is. he don't stop. <laughs> Meaning as in, I love it because it's, it's inspiring that he pushes something that he believes and he loves, and it's great. So I wanna thank Brett, I wanna thank Rose for the opportunity because, you know, 
this bottle right here, I remember like when we introduced it. And oh, we don't have the other bottle here. The, I call it oh, here, the here, black here. one. Yeah, the black one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I That's remember when Ross about. introduced this bottle to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, like this is like the grail. You know what I'm saying? Oh, this is where man. it started. Mm -hmm. And Ross was just, you know, remember, you know, you know, Ross, he lived it. You yeah, know what yeah. I'm saying? You know, like, you know, the yeah. man different. Yeah. The man, you know, no shirt, <laughs> champagne spilling. And it was always the black bottle. Yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? You know, obviously, when we celebrate, how to try it. So I ended up loving it. And then True. I got the opportunity yeah. to be part of the brand. And what I love about it is that we doing things like this. Yeah. And uh, what was it you said earlier? When we hands on mm -hmm. things. Oh, man. You got to say you know, that. Say that quote again. The, the, what was it we called? We do the best when we hands on. Mm -hmm. We do the best when we hands on. And what I love about yeah. Brett is feel he down for whatever. Feel, yeah. Yeah. The man down for whatever. Like we got He down for whatever. And, and obviously you see the success because yeah. He and that's what us. I learned from him. That's when he talked to Brett about me. He was like, you know, you can have a bunch of guys who's it's gonna be a billboard for this thing. He was like, but Wiz really lives it. He's like, everybody who we get down with this brand, they really live this. Shit. Yeah. You know, we in the field, dog. Mm -hmm. We gonna tell you, ah, that ain't it, fam. You no, know, we, it, respectably, like you know what I'm no, saying. It's, like, it's real. we Wiz, love you. When Wiz but that came ain't to it. the crib, Wiz <laughs> really had. Had better weed than me. Come on. Dude. I'm like, how this young nigga got better weed than Rose? <laughs> Stop. On, you feel me? And the nigga really was drinking the was really drinking gin. Yeah, yeah. Turn it up. Everybody too. else, we drinking everything else, and he the only I'm like, yo, this Girls, this real. I was like, yo, where the chicks at? <laughs> He's like, Wiz, this is a family house, bro. Yeah, you feel me? Stop, yeah, man. Yeah, just, just, you can't, I was like, on. all right, I'll go, I'll go Bring somewhere one, else. Bring one, bitch. Bring one. You feel me? You feel me? But it was just, it was and just one of those gin. vibes. But nah, Brett, hey, Brett, it's Brett, it's probably like that, bro. Let me bring them all through, bro. LFG, bro. Like, bro. I live an LFG lifestyle, me, bro. Let's when, fucking go. When you, when you, when you, when you got to meet Brett for the first time, you know, of course, you knew. You could do business with them, but did yeah. you expect what you sat down, the dudes you sat down and got to kick it with? One thing I can say, Brett is an Brett is an un, unforgettable person. Very. Rather you, Very. you if you meet if you've met Brett, Very. you will remember that you met Brett forever. And um Brett is a Brett is a that one of those words we used for Khaled earlier, authentic. Authenticity, but yeah. he's authentic. Right. And um, what he did for me, it was a it was a, a feeling that I got from uh, meeting Brett when he um, went over the whole bumble and the whole situation with me. It felt like he was recruiting. Uh, I felt like I was a a, 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 a recruiting. He was in my <laughs> my, my family's living room. Right, 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 right. D one, you was going D one. Yeah, yeah, it took place sitting down, and he explained about his kids and why he why he got this vision. And he explained the vision, and you know that's when you see that okay, this you know re regardless if it work or not, he's all in. For sure. And so when you see, I, like I said, you we were talking about business earlier. Trust is everything I said in business, and I can trust him because he's all in. He Y'all can see he's all in. Right. So, right. Yeah, I was with him. He all in. Yeah. Right. He hands on. And, and, all and in. awesome G. That took a shot. Soon as we got the recipe ready, he was like, Ugh. I was like, oh, that's a gangster. <laughs> no, nah, he's a gangster. He's a gangster. The nigga chugged this shit as soon as we made it, bro. I'm no, like, damn, no. this got eight different companies. No, 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 real talk, <laughs> real talk. Yo, we know the homie about his paper. We know, we know how successful the homie is. He created Ace of Spades. <laughs> still do say it, that's still his baby. You understand what yes, I'm saying? Yes, it is, yeah, yes so, it is. So these brands right here, but to me, how he touched me, homie, is I had a situation, I ended up in the hospital, right? Mm -hmm. I woke up well, however many days later, my mom's sitting right there, and the first, name, first person name she says is Brett. God Brett bless. Barish. God bless. I say, well, well, you know, almost like what you what you saying his name for? Yeah. Like, she was like, he just left. He been with me, you know, the last X amount of days. Oh, damn. And I said, you know what? I already knew the homie was genuine. You know, mm -hmm. I felt the gangster mm -hmm. in him. When he come to Atlanta, he sleep at my crib. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like that. He one of those. You know what I mean? So, so the love and the energy I see him commit, I say. I can't let homie out hustle me. True. It's too easy. Not only that, we love it. 
So when you talk about it, Cali, we going to the club. I'm partying every night. That's what I just said. We get paid to party at the dopest parties in the world. Mm -hmm. It's got to be the dopest shit in the world, really, to even send an invitation. Don't even send an invitation if the shit ain't fly. It's true. You know what I'm saying? Yes. And when we get there, they already know what I want to enjoy. They already know what I want to drink. Yeah, yeah, nah, it's, 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 it's the red carpet rolled out. Don't no other company cross promote like us, though. Nah, this this yeah. right here is historic. Yeah, yeah. And this is bigger than the it's brands. Natural, you know what I'm the brands like, is make it natural, yeah. but it's bigger than that. This is bigger than us. Yeah. But what I love is that we at this table today, all of us. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's beautiful. You know what I'm saying? Man, it's like, you know, we, we with the brands, but at the same time, we talking that talk. And, you know, we always on stages or in the studio. We never really, like, have time to True. kick it on some. I, I forgot. You just you know what I'm saying, like, what I'm saying, but right. like, you know, this, yeah, this is rare. You know what I'm yes. saying? Like, just keep it honest. You know what I'm saying? We got, that. we busy. Everybody, no, no, busy. no. This, is, this has never been cherished done. This is personal one, time. You this know is what I mean? one so of one. It's right special. Here. It's special. Like, yeah, I want, yeah. I want, I want to make sure I get a dope picture. I want to, I'm framing this pic. You know no. what I mean? Thank you, brother. Man. LFG. What, what that, what that mean again? Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. <laughs> I, love I live an LFG lifestyle. <laughs> <laughs> they let me off the motherfucking plane with a pound of weed on me. Let's go. I love the Queen team, Bel Air, Let's make a Black toast, Bottle man. Boys, Let's make a Tom Boom and his V on if you own. <laughs> with me, baby. KK2. Yeah, LFG. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>